In the last story, we learned about the Venus flytrap, the incredible plant that can count the number of times its tiny trigger hairs are touched before snapping shut. But what if I told you that scientists have discovered even more astonishing signs of intelligence in plants, ones that go far beyond simple counting? After the discovery that the Venus flytrap uses an internal electrical counter to determine when to close, researchers wanted to know, could other plants have their own hidden systems for decision-making? In 2016, scientists from the University of Würzburg in Germany found that Dionea muscipula, the Venus flytrap's scientific name, doesn't just count touches. It can also measure time and remember past touches for nearly 20 seconds. This short-term memory helps the plant decide whether the stimulus is worth the energy cost of closing its trap, an intelligent trade-off for survival. But the discoveries didn't stop there. In 2018, researchers observed that even when kept in total darkness, flytraps maintain their internal biological clock, anticipating day and night cycles. This means their behavior changes depending on the time of day. They're more responsive during daylight when prey is most active. And in 20 to 20, scientists studying Mimosa pudica, the sensitive plant that folds its leaves when touched, found it can learn to ignore harmless stimuli. When repeatedly dropped without being harmed, the plant stopped closing its leaves. Days later, it still remembered the experience and remained calm, a sign of habituation, a simple form of learning once thought to exist only in animals. These findings hint at something profound. Plants might possess a form of distributed intelligence, using electrical and chemical signals similar to brain activity, but without a brain. So next time you see a flytrap snap shut or a mimosa fold its leaves, remember you might be witnessing one of nature's quietest and oldest forms of intelligence. The forest could be far more aware than we ever imagined.